Hello everyone and welcome to another episode of Supermarket Simulator. So we were waiting for the guys to finish restocking and they've just finished. And as you can see, our sidewalk is still a gigantic disaster full of bleach boxes because I can't sell enough of it. Like at all. Nobody wants my bleach and I don't know what to do with it. And I'm just going to have a surplus of bleach forever and ever. Um, we also did, uh, during the live stream, did a bit of reorganizing of the stuff and things and I am not a fan not a fan of this layout at all but it's fine it's gonna work for now we are on a mission to get the last what is it like twenty thousand dollars to unlock that last little square right there and it's taking forever but the guys finished their job they've reloaded all of our shelves all I have to do is go back here and buy more stock which I'm not going to do. It looks like we're doing okay on everything so far. So we're going to go ahead, open the store, and we're going to try to get enough money to finally buy that last corner. Yes, hopefully, hopefully it'll come sooner rather than later. So I shall see you in a few. So we just finished that one day and I think I have an idea. I think I'm going to sell out of everything yet again and I'm only going to stock things that are more than $10. I want to see if people are going to get mad at me for not having things in, uh, in stock, but I would like to just focus on the things that are making us more of a profit because I think more people buying the more expensive items is probably going to be better for us in the long run. So yeah, once we completely sell out of our entire stock room, I don't think I'm going to restock everything. I think I'm only going to focus on the more expensive items, which is going to be interesting. So I'm going to have to start making a list and I will see you guys as soon as this is completely cleared out. Okie dokie. So we ran through like two days and we are definitely selling a lot of our product out, um, but not fast enough. <laughs> so I did actually come back here and deleted some of the labels for the products that we have sold out of, which is basically what I'm doing right now. And this is super fun. It's great content. No, I'm kidding. But uh, yeah, so as soon as we're done selling out of everything, I did just restock all the stuff that we are keeping for the most part. Um, we are doing pretty good on some of the products that we are keeping as far as stock goes anyways. So I didn't have to buy a whole lot, which is great because if you look, we have $52,000, which means... Yeah, it's happening. It is absolutely happening. We are buying this 4x4 section. Okay, let's see. Oh, I can't see. I can't see. Oh, yay. We've got the corner unlocked. I'm so excited. Okay, so we're going to continue on the path that we are on. We're getting pretty low on some of our product, which means we're getting pretty close to selling out of it, which means I can finally do the swap over. So the whole reason I deleted um, the labels in here and the labels back there is I'm wondering is if the labels are gone and we don't have that product in stock at all and we don't have like anything advertising that product, are people going to get upset that we don't have that product in stock. So that science project, I don't know what number are we on, like 472? I don't know, I've lost count. So we're gonna go ahead, open the store, we're gonna run through the day, and then we'll see how angry people are. So we're running through yet another day, and I have no idea what's happening at the shelf. I have no idea what these guys are doing. They're, they're definitely broken. I don't, I don't know what you, what you guys are looking for, man. What, what's going on here? Uh, okay, I think I need to relog, and we'll see if that fixes it. Oh boy. Okay, so relogging just sort of cleared out everyone that was in here. So I guess problem solved. <laughs> Wasn't expecting that. 
Okay, alright, well, we're back at it. So we're running through yet another day, and I am getting a whole bunch of people who can't find products, but I'm hoping that it'll just cycle out. Like, once they realize, oh, hey, we're not selling that anymore, they'll stop complaining that I don't have it in stock. Uh, and I'm getting this idea from a game called Winklesia. And I'm sure I just butchered the name. It means the little shop. And I love that game. Um, and you can sort of specialize in crafting and selling certain types of items. Like there's food, there's armor, there's tools, and stuff like that. And it does... Um, so if you do switch out what you're selling and what you're focusing on, it takes a few days for people to realize, oh, hey, that's not being sold here anymore. Let's just go for what is being sold here. So I'm hoping that the same logic applies, but I'm not sure because I don't know um, the mechanics of this one. So yeah, this is all just one big, huge, giant test. And we're not even close to being at the end of it. So I'm going to keep recording. I'm going to keep going and we'll see where we're at. Okay, so I don't think my science project is working out for me at all, honestly. Um, yeah, 87 products not found. We have six, six satisfied customers and two products found expensive, which, you know, overall not bad for that, but it's this problem that I'm having. And I haven't seen any documentation about whether or not, like, it's tied... What they want is tied to the licenses that you have unlocked or what the case is. So I think I might, um, yeah, I think I might continue to just try to sell out of everything that I have um, and then just keep those products in stock because, I mean, even if I'm losing points, which I'm not really losing as many as I'm getting, um, so... Uh, yeah, like the, the point loss system isn't a huge loss for me. Uh, it, it's fine because that means, you know, I just don't unlock the next license, really. Because if I go into management, I'm nowhere near being able to get this. And I'm already past this level. And I'm past this level. And I'm past this level. And I'm past that level. Like the next section unlock requirement for a... Um, for this one is level 80 and I'm really close to that. I'm halfway there. So I guarantee I'll still hit that. Um, it's just really, huh. I, Cause I was, so I was thinking about getting this license right here and just selling books. But now I'm like, ah, I can't even turn the store into a library because I think everything is tied to the licenses that you've unlocked. And that's what people are looking for. So, yeah, I'm going to go ahead, continue selling uh, some more stuff, and then I think I'm probably going to work on reorganizing the store a little bit. But we'll see. We'll see what happens, and I'll bring you back, and I'll fill you guys in. Oh, boy, has it been a while since I hit the record button. Okay, so I went ahead and rearranged the store yet again. I hated the other layout. I really, really did, um, because we come in and out of this door way more often than we come in and out of the front door. So I really liked having my aisles going down this way. Um, so I did go ahead, restock a bunch of the stuff that we had before. This aisle is pretty much the same. I am going to be adding a shelf out front here that has the fake milk on it. Actually, you know what? I might just stick a shelf over here and put the fake milk with all the sugar. I have nothing over here because I have no idea what I'm going to add over here. I have no idea. No idea. Um, the only thing that I have pretty much sorted out is our cleaning aisle and our booze and the refrigerators that also still need to be reorganized. I did go ahead and do our um, vertical layout 
So we have all of our cheeses because people tend to buy like 10 cheeses at a freaking time here. I, I have no idea who taught them their shopping habits, but that's how they decide to shop. So we're just going to roll with it. Um, our beer is up front. Our water is also up front. I'm probably going to move. I'm going to move <laughs> those over there, possibly. I'm not quite sure yet. Um, I do still have so much running around and so much reorganizing to do. And I am working on getting our uh, storage room set back up. So we do have things organized pretty much in the order that I will have everything out here just because it's easier for me to keep track of what it is that I need to order. Um, although at this point, I guess it doesn't really matter. It's just, it's fine. It's OCD. <laughs> We're just going to run with it. But yeah, I think at this point, what I'm probably going to do is run through the day, um, sell some of my products out, I think. I don't know. You know what? We do still have a, a good chunk of money. But what I wanted to do was earn money to get the license. Uh, if we go into management. Oh, we can afford this. But the only thing is I still have to restock all of the items that we're currently missing. So I'm very slowly going through that process. And yeah, I still have all the bleach, all the bleach. We still have a bunch of bleach outside too. And do I have space? I don't have space for that. That's fine. It's fine. Um, yeah. So I think what I'm probably going to end up doing is wrapping around all of our cleaning supplies because I do want them to have their own little section of a shelf just because it's so much easier on our restockers because they are very slow. They're very, very slow. They take forever to restock things and I have less of an issue of the products not found if I have each product on its own shelf like that. So yeah, I'm going to keep running and I just wanted to give you guys a quick little update and yeah, so I'm going to get right back at it. One actual eternity later and we have made so much progress. Like the only thing I have to fix right now is this beer shelf. I don't have enough beer in there, but everything is organized. Everything is restocked. Everything has its own shelf except for the sodas. Uh, I just sort of cut it off here. I'm not quite sure what I'm going to put in there but we might need three empty shelves. I also have to move the prosciutto over one shelf, but yeah, everything, everything is looking pretty darn good. The only things I have left to do is uh, buy some of this stuff so that I can create spots on my shelf in the stock room for all of it because that's the like one thing that I don't have. So let's go back here, purchase all that. We are almost completely broke. We have $341 left. Oh my gosh. I honestly, I cannot believe that I was able to actually afford all of this because I had to restock absolutely everything. Like, look at, look at this. Look at this. A, it's beautifully organized, but B, it has cost me a small fortune doing this. And I can't believe we actually have some money left over. All right. So let's just do our stock room Olympics here. Uh, where am I? Okay, so that's the butter. Which means this is going to be the start of the freezer stuff. So we'll do that. Get those stupid fake crab sticks in there. And then what comes after the crab sticks? I did that wrong. It was supposed to be chicken. Chicken gets its own shelf though, so it's fine. It's fine. Okay, so crab sticks. And then I think we need a spot for... The red pizza, no, the red pizza, oh, ice cream, ice cream. Okay, so we'll go right back over here and then it's crab sticks and then, did I buy any? I don't think I bought any ice cream. Oh, can I afford it? No, that's fridge. I need uh, any, thank you. One and two and three and four, okay. Okay, oh gosh, $72. Oh, it has been a day. It has surely been a day. Okay, um, and we're also going to do that. And then I think it goes pizza mixed. I think that's what that one is. Um, we'll just slurp these into the back. This is getting occupied by a restocker, so we'll do that manually. It's fine. It's fine. Where did I put it? Down there. All right. 
And then what else do we have out here? More pizza mixed that is occupied by Restocker. Oh, our ice cream. Uh, the red pizza. And where can I put you? I'll put you here. And then actually we do have to manually put this one in because I don't have a spot for it. Okay, so the ice cream is restocked. We have everything pretty much good to go at this point. And I think I'm finally, finally at the point where I can open the stupid store. <laughs> I'm so tired, guys. I've been at this for I don't even know how long. I think my butt is permanently glued to the chair. I have not done anything today except this. Why well, can't... Please just let me put this down. Please, please, please get rid of this issue. I just want to put down this stupid box. Can I please just... Oh, gosh, golly. Okay. All right. I know it's a waste of money, but I don't care. I can't. I can't walk around with beer in my hand all day. And can you get surped up? You can. All right. So, how is everything looking now? Oh, I just moved my monitor IRL, so let me fix that. All right. Okay. Oh, boy. It has been a long one. Right. I have to go grab that green beer. Uh, I think it's this one. Are you confused? Oh, gosh. Daryl, can you stop being confused, man? I don't want to have to re-log. I've had to re-log like 14 times today. Oh. Oh my gosh. Okay. All right. So, um, yeah, I mean, we've made, uh, some progress. We've completely revamped the store. We've got everything all in and all organized and all stocked up. Are you telling me you can't find something? Is there a product that I forgot to put out? Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Okay. I'm going to go hide in my designated corner of hiding and uh, see if they are complaining about prices or if they can't find things. Couldn't find orange juice. <gasps> That's what I'm missing. I'm missing the juice. Oh my gosh. Okay, one, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. Can I please afford it? I can barely. $13 left to my name. OMG. What do I do? What? <laughs> okay, all right. So I think we're going, oh, I'm missing french fries. I knew I was missing other things, ugh. Okay, our orange juice is in. I'm gonna have to find a shelf in the back, but right now I wanna get, oh, yep, perfect, orange juice. Uh, I wanna get everything loaded back in. Oh, I'm missing the milk too, oh boy. Oh boy, okay, there's so many things to keep track of. It's almost impossible. Uh, your pizza? Wait, where's all my refrigerator? Pro oh, I'm gonna have to move literally everything. It's fine. I'll just deal with it in the next game day. It's fine. Okay, milk, 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 milk. Let me go grab the milk. Okay. Oh, I have $788. How did I get that much money so fast? One and two and then three and four. Holy cow. That was... Honestly, that was pretty crazy. I was not expecting to get that much money so fast. <laughs> all right. Okay, everybody should be able to find all of the stuff and things that we have available. And then hopefully, after the end of today, I can get the book license. And I want to start selling books because I feel like we need to. I'm not quite sure why, but I feel like it's something that has to happen. And I'm also going to move this shelf way closer to this one, like how these all are. And then I should have enough space to stick a shelf for books uh, behind it. I think. I hope. I don't know. We'll find out. We'll find out. Stay tuned next time. No, I'm kidding. <laughs> we'll find out this time. But uh, yeah, so I'm going to let today run out. Uh, hopefully we'll get enough money for that book license and I'll see you all in just one second. Okay, so we're at the end of the day and all of my stalkers have completely bugged out. <laughs> They're just completely broken. Store points, 1500. Why? That's so many. I keep getting so many points. 
Uh, but yeah, so all of our stalkers are just mesmerized by all of the boxes and have not done any work out at, at all. At all. So, um, the other thing is I realized I forgot to get potatoes. So I have an order of potatoes and I have an order of shelves and we are very quickly getting our finances right back up. And also that's the wrong aisle. So let's stick this shelf right in here. Perfect. And then we're going to go and grab a stack of our potatoes out of our tower of potatoes. And we're going to put them right here with the candy and the chips because <laughs> I don't know why. I don't have anywhere else to put them. Like, I have very limited options for organizing this place. And because I've forgotten half of the products that are sold in this place, a couple of things are going to be a little bit wonky. And that's okay. That's perfectly fine. All right. So I think we need just one more box of potatoes. And then I can start sorting out where these are going to go into the back rooms. So let's hook over these and uh what am i doing right i also wanted to reorganize our booze shelf and we don't have enough money for the um the book license but that's okay we are going to be getting it we're absolutely going to be getting it uh okay so that's two four six eight and that's exactly how many we need so i'm gonna come back here i'm gonna grab a bottle of whiskey Actually, before I do this, I'm going to quickly relog. I'll be our bees. Okay, they are working as normally, so that's good. Uh, all right, so now what I want to do, I, you know what? I honestly probably should have waited, but it's fine. We're just going to put all the whiskey up here and then all the rest of it over here, and then we're going to swap the wine over here, and then we're going to do this, and then we're going to do that, and we're going to actually move all these over here, and then do that and now can I fit you I cannot and I can't fit you uh, okay so we're gonna clear this shelf of the vodka first we're gonna delete the label refill that zerp that zerp okay I am not going to zerp that because the rack is apparently full which is all right it's perfectly fine um I feel like I'm gonna need more whiskey to fill out that shelf over here. Unless they're already working on it. I'm not quite sure what they're doing. No, he is working on the other beer. Okay. Alright, I should have uh, an empty box that that beer comes in, which is the big square one we have, and then we have this one, which... Is that? Yeah, okay. That's the one that has the six packs of beer in it, so... Uh, we'll just scoot our booties over here. Uh, could you get your box out of my face? Thank you so very much. And also, we need to move that other vodka. So let's grab a box of that. Nope, that's the wrong vodka. Uh, back here. And then you come with me. We have a mission, you and me, Mr. Vodka. Okay, so then this vodka is going to go here. And then this one's going to go down here. We're going to scoop up all that we can. Oh, put that box down. And then uh, I left my uh, big box to get rid of the kegs. Okay. I swear these boxes are, uh, are made out of TARDIS magic. Because those things look gigantic. And then you put them in the box and it's like, oh, well, they're not so big. <laughs> all right. Okay. So now where'd my little... All right, okay, that's fine. We'll just do this. Grab these, stick these in here. We'll grab these and stick those down here. And then we can grab, um, where do I want my other beer to go? I think I want my other beer to go over here. I think that makes sense. And then we can clear this shelf out put that down there, delete the label so he doesn't come out here and restock, and then box doesn't match size. Box doesn't match size? What? What do you mean box doesn't match the size? Box doesn't match size. Oh, 
Oh, oh, I see. I see. Okay, I see what I did. I'm just being a derp. That's all. It's perfectly uh, normal and fine uh, because that's, that's what I do. That's what I do best. All right. So we'll move all this beer over here. We're going to pick this beer up. We're going to put it up here because we don't want them. Re Could you please get the box out of my face, Daryl? I'd appreciate that so very much. Okay. So what's in here? Our kegs, which I think I want going down this side. And then these ones I can also move out of the way. All right. So let's huh, kick the box around the store. It's perfectly fine. We'll just grab all that delete that label grab this and get those situated and oh, the box in the face daryl daryl can you please okay get that loaded up move this one over and then that one and delete our labels and then that's the wrong box i need this box and then we can just Zerp all those down there. Fantastic. Okay, so now I can take... Oh, wait a second. Hold on. Hold on. I forgot about these... Uh... Oh, I need... Oh, excuse me, Daryl. Oh, I need these boxes. Okay. And then we'll refill that. Please just empty the box. Thank you. Get that out of here. Oh, get that out of here. Delete these labels. And then scooch all this stuff over. All right, now I just need to make sure that those are correct. They are, and then that's not the one I use for the vodka. That's the one I use for the vodka. And that, no, wrong one. I want that and, and that down there. Perfect. Okay, so now our booze shelf is completely, completely organized and everything has its own place. Fantabulous. All right, so let's go zerp that onto the shelf. Do our stock room and grocery store Olympics. Get that one on down there. And then I think besides waiting on the guys to restock, we're pretty much good. I think. I think. <laughs> I feel like every time I say we're good to go, I'm forgetting something else or I'm missing something else or I'm missing a product or something. Oh, I feel like every time I say it, I jinx myself. Okay, so let me just double check. We'll grab a couple of those. We'll grab two of these. One of those. We're good on the wine. We definitely need some more whiskey. And we need some more of the blue vodka. And we'll grab some more shelf chicken. And what's up here? Butter. Uh, we'll grab two ice cream. Okay, we'll change that to one ice cream. <laughs> Where is it? Okay. Okay, that should be a good start, I think. Did I just lose a whole bunch of points? Oh, right, right. We have to figure out where we're putting potatoes. Um, I also have to move... Oh, gosh, this issue. Can't deal with it. I cannot deal with it. Okay, Um, where do I have my green laundry detergent because I'd like to put my purple one with that and I feel like I might have forgotten to actually designate an area no it's right there it's right there okay so we're gonna move our purple one over here uh we don't need a spot for that on the shelf for right now because that was just extra so we'll just do this and make sure we have all of the storage space ready for our potatoes and now where's our purple stuff okay that's gonna go down here and now i should be able to just zerp up not that uh please just go on the floor there we go potatoes and our beer and then this was occupied by a restocker do i have space i think i, I should have space for it okay all right so now I'm going to open the store, we're going to run through the day, and we're going to see where we're at financially, and I'll see you all in just a second. So it's been about four days in-game, and we finally have enough money to get... Uh, well, we're going to have to buy all the things that I need to restock the store, but we should also have enough 
to get yes yes we have enough to get the book license oh my gosh okay oh wait no i still need the computer what am i even doing okay uh market and then products and then shelf and then all the way down at the bottom <gasps> okay so it looks like a bunch of children's books okay we'll grab four of each and see if I can afford that. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. Okay. We can. I feel like they're probably not going to sell for a whole lot. Uh, that's sushi. That's not books. What size box do the books come in? That's chicken. The rack is full. Oh, okay. Okay. So we have our first set of books and we're just going to put them down this aisle. So, oh, Oh, I like the way they get displayed at an angle. That's really cool. What are you, vodka? You're not a kid's book. Uh, zerp all that up. Okay, all right. So here's the next one. Can I only fit eight to a shelf and there's only eight in a box? Ugh, I don't like that at all. Oh, uh, that's hamburger meat. Okay, let's try this again. That's more chicken books. Okay. Uh, down here. Okay. We'll get these in. I feel like we're probably not going to make a whole lot of money off of the books. I thought they would be worth a bit more than they are. Yeah, they're eight bucks for a book. How much is this one? Ten. Okay. And then more of the mother and child. So let's get this all down here. I feel like I should probably do the same thing with the green book and then go find a spot in the back rooms for it. So let's see. I don't think I have a spot in the back rooms. I'm going to have to buy another rack. All right. Let's see. Uh, furniture, a small rack. Grab that. And we are very quickly losing out on a bunch of money, but it's, it's perfectly fine. It is what it is. Okay. We're just going to stick that right there. Okay. Colors. Is this a color? What does that say? Oh, it's a puzzle book. Okay. That's cool. And we'll get these all down the line. And then, let's see. This is our rack, right? All right. So it'd be the third one down. So we'll stick that there. And then I, I won't share. <laughs> now, is this book teaching children to not share or to share? I am curious about that. Okay. Let's go get this one on the rack uh, down here. Perfect. And what one is this? Ham. That's not a book. That's ham. That's a book, though. Uh, I think I can, I cannot surf that up because the restocker is already over there. So we'll just put it there manually. How about you? You're the same thing. Uh, occupied by a restocker. How about you? Okay, we can zerp that up. Rack is full. That means we don't have a spot for this one. This one goes up here. And what are you? Oh, a dynamical theory of the electromagnetic field. Oh, <laughs> it's fun to learn. <laughs> All right. Yeah, it sure is fun to learn the theoretical explanation of stuff and things. I've already forgotten what the title of the book was. Okay, is this the last one? One, two, three, four, five, six. Yeah, I think this should be the last book. All right, so let's go throw this box out. I didn't even read the title of that one. Let's, uh, I cannot zerp you because restockers. Uh, okay, we'll throw that in there. Donnie Corso de Letiture. I, I don't know. I'm not French. Sure. Okay. Yep. All right. That's fine. <laughs> no idea. Oh, wait. This one goes after. Uh, I think the rainbow one goes up there. Let's see, what are you, mother and child? Can I zerp that? I can. Okay, and there's the rainbow one, so we can put that one up top here. I know, guys, I'm sorry. I'm adding so much more work to your uh, already busy day. Okay, so we'll just put these in ourselves, and that it will be just fine. All right, throw the box out. 
Can I zerp that? I cannot zerp that. It's fine. We'll just stick it back here. And it looks like my shelves are getting dangerously low. Uh, rack is full. How about this one? Rack is full. I accidentally overordered milk and occupied by a restocker. Okay. We'll throw this one here. Am I missing a book? I think I am. Yeah, the um, the ABC book. Okay, so let's just scan that. Come back here, order that, and now we'll have a spot for it in the back rooms. Boop. All right, okay. Okay, all right. So we have got all of our books... Finally, finally doing something with these licenses. I feel like it's been forever since we bought a license and I'm sure it probably hasn't been. It just feels that way for me because it takes so long to get anything done in this game at this point. Okay, so um, I know we're absolutely waiting on this one until I can get even more expansions because there's no way I'm fitting all this freezer stuff in our current layout. Um, and then the cleaner and the cat food I'll probably also hold off on. But these ones I know I can definitely make fit. These ones I can definitely get to fit. The books, probably not. <laughs> we'll figure it out later. Um, and then this is just more cakes. Yeah, all this stuff I can definitely incorporate into our current layout. Um, how I'm going to do so is beyond me, but I really want to get the next expansion set. So let's go to growth. And this is going to take a while. And I think I'm probably going to do another live stream to get the money for these three. And that's probably going to be like a 12 hour live stream. <laughs> I don't know if I'm going to stream that long, but I feel like it's definitely going to have to happen in a stream because I have been at this for nine and a half hours it is 10 30 at night on april 13th right now and i have been at this since like two in the afternoon i it's been a long day a very long day and i have done nothing but grind in this game so i definitely do not want to spend another like three days. Oh yeah, so that's on top of like the gameplay I've already done for like three days. So it's, yeah, it's taken a while. It takes a very long time to get anywhere once you hit late game. But that is going to do it for this episode, guys. I really hope that you enjoyed the episode. We did so much reorganizing. We did so much restocking of the stuff and things. We got our book license. Yay! And, uh, yeah, I, I can't, I, I, I just, I, I can't wait until our store is bigger so I can get everything in a, the layout that I want it to be in. So, but yeah, I hope that you enjoyed the episode. If you did, please hit the like button. If you haven't already, consider subscribing as well. And yeah, let me know what you think of the current layout in the comments below. And I'll see all of you later.